I'm Angelo. I'm here to talk to you about massaging grass for men as a way of feeling better and healing. In this video, I show you simple low budget or no budget ways of trying to come to terms with things you're feeling for men without spending money at a therapist's office and without resorting to self-medicating or abusing drugs or alcohol or other substances or uh, using uh, rage to take out your anger on others. I discovered this technique on one of my near daily trips to the park since I live in my car and I don't have a home and I just use the park to walk around in to fill my water bottles, go to the bathroom, and uh, I see all this grass around me and I think, why let it go to waste? You know, with my dad dying and getting a dissociative disorder, which that's a whole nother, don't even get me started on that one. I found that a simple way to relieve some of my tension is to literally just massage the grass and feel like you're nurturing it nurturing something that's growing because I don't really have family or you know friends or uh, and I can't handle being around people a lot and getting started is just one simple step the fuck you look and here we go so just follow along and go at your own pace you can do these as quickly or as short as you want. You can let your mind wander. Me, I think about how I dropped out of college after going for four years. Uh, I was in excruciating pain for much of it. And by the end, I just had a relapse of my dissociative disorder. I couldn't feel anything. Either way, I wasn't interested in graduating. I think I'll just move on to another one right here. Now notice this little fella standing up tall and straight. This person didn't get cut like these other blades of grass. And you got several techniques you can use. You can use the stroke, as I'm demonstrating now, the poke, the squeeze, or the T's. I'll just keep stroking this one for a while. Been living in my car for 17 or 18 months now. Two cars actually. Last one was destroyed, but uh, was kind of fortunate in that uh, it was a uh, falling apart, overheating. Maybe it just needed a new reservoir cap, and it wasn't starting right. The catalytic converter was bad. And then uh, one night. I was just sleeping in my car and at 2.30 in the morning I wake up and I hear a horrible noise and my car is being uh, pushed down the road or skidding down the road. Someone crashed into my rear. I went to the hospital and uh, couldn't really exercise for a month. Just stroking that blade of grass. If you got friends, you can do this with them too, although it can be too intense with a couple guys around. 
Again, this is a video for men. What's that grass feeling? What's it thinking? Why is this sky growing so much taller than all the others? I was always an underachiever. I could have done more. Just didn't really want to. Didn't care enough. And I was beset with uh, several roughly year-long episodes of dissociative disorder, which uh, yeah, pretty much disabled me at times. Look at that grass go down. And up, down, and up. You can focus on any blade of gra grass you want. It doesn't have to be just the tall one. It can be this little bent over one right here. Picture whatever you like. There are no mistakes here, there are no uh, unfortunate endings, just happy endings. You can use your left hand, or you can use your right hand. You can wear gloves if you want to do this. like imagining I'm getting this nectar out of the grass. Uh, probably best not to think about... Well, I won't even get into it. It's, it's so bad to think about it, but... Uh, yeah. Feel anguish when your mind starts to wander. A fly landed near my left hand, and it looks like it just committed suicide. It just flew straight into the ground and buried itself. If you haven't touched another person in a while, you can touch this grass. I'm sure the grass is uh, cut regularly where my dad is laying, Arlington Cemetery. But this little stinker just won't. Just, he's like, nope, I'm not going down today. That's for another day. And I wonder where I'll be laid to rest someday. I'll be a nice little happy fellow like this, or a little little one that looks like it just got a fresh haircut. And went to the barber and said, eh, a little off the top, please. Now here's a, look at that, just. Just grab it. can make up a poem. Make 
up a poem. Any poem you like. Why is this grass here? How did it get here? From billions of years of evolution, not if you've read the Bible, but it and I are cousins. We have the same ancestors. I wave around in the wind and the grass can wave or can stay. I, I wave at the grass as I massage it. The grass bounces back when I toss it. Do you name your grass? Or is your grass anonymous? This one's dopey, bashful, sleepy, grumpy, hickory dickory dock. Uh, 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 sleepy. Sometimes you think a touch is just, you know, you know, clobber, clobbering somebody or somebody clobbering you. I could tell a few stories about that. You look at your hands, you remember scars, where you got them. Where did I get? This one right here, split my knuckle open, punching a guy in the face. Or more the jaw, I hit him. Uh, back when I was a bouncer. Then my hands were a different thing, but now I'm not a man of fighting. Uh, although I think about it a lot, I just uh, want to touch this grass. Touch that grass. Oh, look. Oh, my God. <laughs> I see that sneak up on me. I'm like, what the fuck? And if you like percussion during your poetry to set a beat, don't spend money on a musical instrument. Uh, I just used this old can of oatmeal. I still have some oatmeal left, even after some spilled at the bottom of my car seat, and just beat that. I do this because I can't really yet mourn the dead uh, because of my dissociative disorder. It cuts me off from my feelings, so. All right, bye everyone, and uh, if enough people like this video, maybe I'll show how to massage grass for men at night.